Yo, what's going on guys? This is Keg back here with another Animal Jam video. And in today's video guys, I'm going to be talking about how Animal Jam YouTubers, one in specific, how they have been getting hacked lately. Now, if you're kind of a smaller creator for this game, I don't think you generally have to worry about this, uh, nor if you have your email public. If you don't have it public, I don't think you should worry about this either. This is generally for typically the larger side of Animal Jam YouTubers that kind of have business emails for sponsorships and whatnot in their descriptions and whatever which is what i'm going to be talking about here so as you can see in the den i'm in i'm in neon visions den and if you don't know her channel lately has been facing a big hack with her channel name being changed multiple times multiple streams without her knowledge being put up as well as being view botted and like botted and to top it all off videos getting removed from her channel now i want to talk all about this and how it actually happened because neon actually told me that in discord group chat i'm in with her and astro squad and i'll talk about that later in the video so pretty much what happened was neon was actually approached by a sponsorship deal by i don't really know what how to pronounce this i'm pretty sure it's like foxes or something or flaws as i'm not too sure it was pretty much supposed to be kind of a app for conversing with other people about business i'm assuming i don't really know for sure don't download this app stay away from it i don't think you can even google search it i think you need the, the link directly but don't even try downloading it it will not end <laughs> nicely to say the least so this sponsorship ended up contacting neon seeing that she had a large audience and wanted to know if she wanted to sponsorship now they sent her a document file so a google document file and in that document she accidentally downloaded a file which was an msi file now if you don't know what that is it's kind of like an exe it's pretty much just an installer for programs and she accidentally downloaded it and she clicked on it so it made it open whenever it finished downloading and apparently she couldn't cancel the download either which is also pretty weird and once it actually fully installed the hackers that's what you want to call them actually took control of her computer apparently and that's how she pretty much just lost her youtube channel overnight they pretty much removed any kind of devices she still had connected to her google account aka her youtube account so she couldn't get back into it now they didn't reset her stream key so meaning she can go live on her channel still at the moment although she can't really do anything else now i touched at the start of the video that her name on her channel has actually went under a couple changes since this hack i'm pretty sure at some point it was named mike bloomberg and then it was later changed to softbank company now it's been speculated that the, the hacker just straight up sold neon's channel which it wouldn't be surprising to be honest if you don't know youtube channels do actually go on sale sometimes and especially if they're monetized and have quite a large audience on it they can go for thousands of dollars which is against the YouTube terms of service by the way so you should not do that if you are planning anyway now I don't know from the very start if they sold it or if they changed it to Mike's Mike Bloomberg and then sold it either way both of these aliases I guess both had to do with cryptocurrency in some way Bloomberg US was the name of the channel name uh, when it was associated with Mike Bloomberg I'm pretty sure which has some association to cryptocurrency as well but soft back company is purely crypto now i'll put some screenshots on the screen right on screen right now of her stream actually being hacked so these companies in quotations companies going live on her channel if you don't know what a cryptocurrency is it, I, I don't really know how to explain it to be honest in simple terms i guess it's just digital money and it's worth a lot i i guess that's really all i can say however specifically in bitcoin bitcoin is very valuable and they were pretty much trying to scam people through this live stream right now it's pretty 
much the oldest trick in the book. You give me this and I give you double back. People use this on Animal Jam for God's sake. How do they expect that Bitcoin, an actual currency, people will fall for this? Now, this is also where the view bots and the like bots come in place as they view botted the stream to try to get it up in the YouTube recommended section, which I'm not sure if it worked. However, when they were view botting, it ended up view botting Neon's stream at the same time because she was live when they were live on her channel also. So there was two streams going on, the SoftBank one and then her channel as well. So her, her own stream. She was pretty much just telling people what was happening, why her name changed, what the other stream was, why there were so many viewers on the stream. And I'm pretty sure that catches everything up to date. Now, Astro Squad, I actually added Neon to a group chat with them and they are trying to help her with this whole thing, try to get her whole channel back. They're trying to do something with the actual file that actually routed her computer to try to see who sent it, see if they can actually go in contact with them, or at least do something for them for doing this now. I also want to talk about how I also uh, almost experienced this myself now, uh, which is kind of weird. Around last week, I don't know if I still have screenshots of this, it was just a VPN sponsorship. It was also Russian, which was uh, obviously the first alarm kind of. It was a VPN service sponsorship offer and yeah, they pretty much said, yeah, we'll pay as much as you want and they gave me an offer and I was like, okay, well, let me see their website first. And the email was marked as a phishing link, I think, or just an unsafe link. And not to mention when I went to the website, it actually wasn't secure. So that's also another false alarm. So I tried try to download the file from the website and then it just wouldn't download. So I don't know if that's just a problem with their little uh, their little hack there that didn't end up working. But either way, um, I tried to contact them after that and they just went ghost. So I reported their account and then, uh, you know, I kind of avoided that swiftly. But now I'm going to be telling you how to avoid this for yourself if you're kind of on the larger side of YouTube. Now, if you want sponsorships, you will need to leave your business email somewhere on your channel, in your videos, whatever, doesn't matter. I would recommend if you are getting sponsorships, look into the company beforehand. If you, you, if you can't find it or a reliable source of it, giving it like a good review or something like that, just ignore it. Don't reply until you see some valid credentials, I'm assuming, especially if it is with a software that they are requiring you to download and install, then definitely look into it as hard as you can. Now, in the pinned comments, you can find a phrase. I want you guys to actually go to Twitter and tweet that at Team YouTube. People are trying to help Neon as fast as possible to recover her channel, and this will speed up the process if you guys can do this. She is, you know, kind of suffering from this, and personally, I know what it is to feel like to lose a channel. Obviously, I've had a channel before this one, and I really wouldn't want to see Neon's channel suffer from the same fate because it seems like these streams that uh, SoftBank Company are doing, it's a non-stop loop of the video on the stream, meaning it will keep going until their stream is essentially deleted or the account, so Neon's account is terminated. So it seems like they're trying to do something along them lines. I'm not too sure. I will keep you guys updated. However, if you do want that, let me know in the comments also. I'm not gonna add, uh, advertise the, the giveaway I have going on right now because it's more serious kind of subject I want to address but yeah uh, that's gonna wrap up the video here it's kind of a long one longer one than usual make sure to subscribe with notifications on to be notified on my videos as well as videos just like this one if you did like today's video make sure to leave a like on it and let me know what you thought of it in the comments below did you like it did you hate it and I will catch you guys in the next one